once once i would like to yeah, yeah. ask you one question because these things no, nobody talks about uh, the thing is that bsc in pure sciences and bsc in forensic science do you think hmm. uh, bsc in pure sciences get some uh, get a bit of preferences over a bsc forensic sciences yeah 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 they will get even i am i'm the student of uh, life science i have yeah. done bsc yeah, you said me you told, you told me that yeah yeah i have done bachelor's in life science yeah. and i have taken msc forensic science so mm-hmm. i have better scope if i go in uh, this one the biology division or mm-hmm. chemistry division i mm-hmm. can get place easily okay mm-hmm. and the student who comes from bsc forensic science and the student will take same msc forensic science they will mm-hmm. not they are not eligible for this contract basis okay in cfsl labs that okay. thing we have to understand okay if any student want to be in forensic science they yeah. have to go from uh, bsc life science pure science yeah they have to take this subject and then they have to come for msc forensic science okay then they will get the eligible uh, they will get the eligibility to study the, uh, on the to work in cfsl as an contract basis or permanent basis okay yeah. and uh, next is uh, permanent job eligibility mm-hmm. so here we will have uh, like each state has a fsl has its own standard procedure for recruitments depending mm-hmm. upon the division uh, how they recruit Mm-hmm. there and there is no similar type of procedure in all the states every state yeah. have their own procedures own procedures and the vac- yeah yeah and the vacancy here come time to time at state level and central level 